First off, I'm gonna start off with saying the localized name is so stupid. I don't know why you would put two so's back to back. So I'm a spider, so what? Why is it not, yeah, I'm a spider, so what? Or, I'm a spider, so? Like, there's literally hundreds of different ways you probably could have translated that, and it still would have gotten the point across. By including two so's, my brain just automatically removes it and just calls it, I'm a spider, so what? Or, yeah, I'm a spider, so what? I don't know, it's just real stupid to me that they did that. With that out of the way, I guess, this show is boring as hell. I mean... It's literally slime, right? You know, that time I got reincarnated by a slime, or I guess Tinsura is like the abbreviated Japanese name. It's that, but if it took what that show did in its one episode and stretched it to three episodes and counting, I shit, it's still not over yet. It's just not good. It focuses on the, the spider leveling up. You know, whereas in slime in the first episode, spoiler alert, I guess, he eats a fucking dragon and he's immediately out of the dungeon and the grinding he does do in the dungeon is well, number one, not CG. And number two, it is wrapped up pretty quickly. You know, it, it's just kind of montage. I'm a spider decides to, yeah, well, let's not do that. Instead, we're going to spend multiple episodes on it. And when we're not focusing on the spider, we're going to focus on the rest of the spider's class that also got reincarnated, but most of them are human. And not only does it feel disjointed when it does that, like I get why it does it, because I'm sorry, if the first episode would have just ended with more, yeah, the spider's going to grind for, for more episodes, I probably would have dropped it episode one. It hooked me with the, the, the idea that, oh, the rest of the class got reincarnated. You know, like Ari Fruetta, but not absolute dog shit. Turns out I was wrong. While it's not absolute dog shit, it is boring. Because episode 2 onward, yeah, they cut between the two, but the humans are just so uninteresting. They're so cliched, especially the one angry, like, Bakugo wannabe, that whenever I'm watching them, I'm just bored out of my skull, and I want it to go back to the spider. And then when it does go back to the spider, I'm like, oh god, why did I want this? This is even worse. The literal only thing that makes this show bearable to me is that Ao Yuki is the one that voices the spider, and she's great. She's fantastic in pretty much whatever she does, but especially here, as the spider. Like, it's very entertaining. And I'll be real with you, I like shitty isekai shows, yeah, but I drop them if they're bad. The only reason why I haven't dropped this is because the opening tells me she's gonna become a big tittied hot anime girl with white hair, and I'm totally down for that. You know, like that bitch from, like, Demon Slayer? Yeah, I'm down for that shit. That's the only reason why I'm still watching it. <laughs> As a show itself, it's uninspired, like most isekai, but on top of that, it's not? How do I put this? Clever, I guess? I don't know. It's, it's literally just copying slime, but it's doing it worse. Like, I've seen shows copy other shows. But usually it's like a, you know, change the homework before they turn it in. No, this literally copies it almost one for one, but makes it more boring. They're like, well, the how I'm gonna make it different is I'm just not gonna skip all the boring shit. And it's like, wh why? What are you insane? That's what the hell's wrong with you. Now your show is ass, you know? Like, yeah, maybe it gets better down the line, but most people drop shows after three episodes, one to three episodes, and you have still not impressed by three episodes. So I'm not really sure why anybody should stick around to watch you. The music is forgettable. Like, I barely even notice it half the time. That's granted, that's the case for most isekai, but that's still a point against it. The animation is bad. The spider is entirely in CG for some reason. Even though that there's a little dragon thing, like well, there's another classmate and it's a dragon, a little, little, little weird dragon companion, and it's in 2D, but yet the spider's in CG? Like, why is the spider in CG? Isn't, wouldn't the other thing take more damage? I get the spider moves around more, but like, I don't know. Speaking of which, the spider also becomes 2D in some shots, and I'm just confused as to why. I'm like, why not just keep it CG all the time? Wouldn't that be easier? I don't know. It's really stupid. And the other point it has against it is the plot. Like, again, it's a 24 episode long isekai, I'm sure it's gonna go somewhere eventually. Slime was slow too, and I mean currently is, in its second season, but I mean slime hooked me in those first few episodes. Well this is not, and it seems like it's gonna keep prattling on like this for the next few episodes. I definitely can't recommend this. It's boring. If you love trashy isekai, it's not even that because there's barely any fan service and there's no power fantasy because she's grinding to get to the top. So I'm not really sure why you would watch this unless you're just like me and you're waiting for the spider to get hot or if you're in the spiders themselves, which hey man, I don't judge. Or maybe that's your shit taste opinion that you have is that you think all oh, isekai are great. So you watch everyone or you feel obligated to just like I feel obligated to watch every show. In that case, knock yourself out. But for anybody else who Who's just wandering and passing maybe you liked slime sekai or any of the other ones that are similar to it and you're like maybe i'll give this one a try don't 
It's god awful. Again, it might get better. But if a show is going to take like five or six episodes to get good, you probably shouldn't bother with it. Yeah, this is a 24 episode show, so it's not halfway through its runtime, but it's still considerably far in for it to finally have something happen. Maybe binge it when it comes out if you really like this kind of shit, but definitely don't watch this weekly because God, it's boring. That's all I've got. Remember, like and subscribe. If you like the video, that should, you know, lets me let you watch to the end. I don't think anybody does, but hey, prove me wrong. But yeah, see ya.